Well, good morning and welcome everyone. It's so good to have you on board here at Mabula and what a beautiful day it is to get out and about on a game drive this morning. It's so good to have you with us. Our plan is for the day to head up a little bit further north into the reserve, hopefully uh, find some elephants for you all and maybe a bit of birding along the way. But we'll take whatever we can find and we can't wait to get out there and have you on board with us. Wow, what a beautiful scene here with this Gempsbok just below the mountain or the hill. You can just see the horns there catching the sunlight. Doing a bit of grooming now. They are such a such beautiful antelopes in so many ways but their coloration is very iconic and of course those very long sharp horns on top of their head well another animal that is waking up and starting to get going this morning are monkeys i can hear them I think this is a member of a troop that's in the area and uh, it's actually looking so pretty in the sunshine this morning. I love how they seem to be able to perch on the most finicky branches. There we go, that one's heading down now. But often monkeys do like to sit at the tops of trees and things like that to have a good view out over anything. If they did spot something like a predator, they would do some alarm calling. Well, we have found a little brown hooded kingfisher. It's been flying about around us, but finally sitting still. It's busy hunting this morning, looking for any creepy crawly that it can find at the moment in the grass. We have also found some beautiful zebras in the morning light. Wow, there's something special about the black and white contrasted with the yellow grass and the light coming through from behind them. We've got three, there were four swallow-tailed bee-eaters, everyone. This is so cool. This is a new bird for me, a lifer. And I did see them on the list for Mabula and I thought, oh, maybe, maybe not. What are the chances we'd actually see them? And here they are perched so beautifully for us in the sun. And they're called swallow-tailed bee-eaters because of their tails, of course, being forked. They also are bright blue in their tail. It's sort of a mixture between a blue-cheeked bee-eater and a little bee-eater. You can even see the blue just below their eye as well. So, so stunning. Just have a look at them catching the light like that. Wow! How gorgeous! Absolutely incredible. The highlight of my day for sure. Well, we have made it up towards the north, everyone, and uh, it's actually been really cool so far. We've seen some zebras, some birds along the way, and um, now we're looking out for elephants. I'm excited. Uh, there's no signs of them just yet, but we are heading uh, towards the area that they were last seen. There's also a nice water hole that they often drink at, so we're going to be checking out all of that and hopefully good luck with this morning. We found the elephants everyone, this is so exciting, oh my goodness, they are just moving parallel to us in the tree line, I'm hoping that they're going to come out very soon, but hooray. Oh, he's going to snap, oh there we go, wanted to get to that piece of the tree and just the ease at which they can snap off a branch like that is unbelievable.
Oh, he just placed his foot on that tree and it snapped like a twig. She's actually got a slight lump on her right side there. It's quite normal. I mean, we do see elephants with, well, animals sometimes with lumps and bumps. It may just be a buildup of fatty tissue. I think I see the bull now right at the back. I mean, he stands head and shoulders above the others. It's amazing when you don't have a comparison in size. Sometimes you can think a female could be a male. But yeah, when, when you see him, you can really see how much bigger he is in, in comparison. <laughs> there were leaves stuck in its trunk. <laughs> Wow, what a sighting, guys. We saw them all the way from the beginning. It's come out and do their thing, and now they're like right out in the open. These elephants have found a juicy green bush in the heart of winter, and they are enjoying it, to say the least. Well, here we have the bull that I was speaking about finally come out into the open for all of us. And he's taken a snack for the road as he's moving from one thicket to the next. Well, it really has been a fantastic morning here at Mabula today. Wow. Plenty of time with these beautiful elephants. Thank you so much for joining us, everyone. It's been awesome having you with us today, and we'll see you again on the next one.